Hi everyone, today you're going to learn various ways to make and respond to invitations in both formal and informal situations. Try to repeat the phrases to practice your pronunciation. Here are some phrases for making an invitation. You can start by asking if the other person is available with the phrases, are you doing anything? and are you free? For more formal invitations, use the phrase, would you like to? And for more informal invitations, you can use wanna and do you wanna? Let's start by asking the other person about their availability. You can say, are you doing anything this weekend? Or, are you free tomorrow afternoon? Notice that we don't say, are you? We say, are you? Try to repeat the question. Are you doing anything this weekend? Are you free tomorrow afternoon? If the person is available, then you can make your invitation. For a more formal invitation, use would you like to. Would you like to join me for lunch? Would you like to see a movie tomorrow night? Again, we don't say, would you like to. In natural spoken English, it sounds like, would you like to. Try to repeat the questions. Would you like to join me for lunch? Would you like to see a movie tomorrow night? For informal invitations among friends, you can use wanna and do you wanna. Both of these are the short forms of do you want to? Try to repeat the questions. Want to go hiking on Saturday? Do you want to grab some coffee after class? Now let's learn how to respond to an invitation. Here are three possibilities for saying yes, accepting the invitation. I'd love to. Sure. Sounds good. Sounds great. If you want to say no to the invitation, use these phrases. I'd love to, but... For example, I'd love to, but I have other plans. I don't think I can. I'm really sorry, but... For example, I'm really sorry, but I have to pick up my kids from school. If you want to express the hope that the other person will invite you again in the future, you can say, I'll have to take a rain check, or maybe another time. Now you know how to make and respond to invitations in English. If you want to learn more spoken English to use in practical situations, check out the Travel English course, which will teach you lots of phrases and expressions for traveling and everyday social situations in English-speaking countries.